Hello. Hello. Now we're still eating this. Look a bit red. It's divine. Right. I shouldn't be talking about eating. I have a package from Japan. Tonight, all the way from Japan. Unboxing video. I'm just gonna mime this by everyone else. I think this is a. Marazen is a what? A Japanese department store. I have some mysterious package. Actually, I I know what it is. I, at least I think I know what it is. I I gave my friends some very specific instructions to um. A, li a shopping list, basically, to get stuff, and um. And this is what he got me. It is a box. It is a black box. Oh wait, it's a pilot. We are good. Do you want to photo bomb, sir? This is a pilot thing. It's like how you call it a box. We have an audience. Oh my god, I have pressure. Oh wow. That is a really nice leather case. Wow. And comes with free crack cocaine. This is a Pilot Custom Heritage 912 with an SF nib. Thanks, Aaron. This is lovely. Uh, this... I have not had a pen before, which is black and silver. And... It is a cartridge. This is a Con70. It's a Con70 cartridge converter. I don't know how to use this. Oh, it pumps. Okay. But I don't have a Pilot cartridge on me, do I? It comes with one, which I don't care about. Do I have any pilot pens? Dry test this for the moment. Comes with a leather, leather pouch. Very light. Reasonably, reasonably large. Should I peel off this SF? Am I allowed to? I am. It's fine. So. Pretty nice nib. This is a Pilot 14K SF nib. Postable. I don't have any. Oh, I feel some softness. Okay. Let's try this out with. I only have one Pilot pen on me right now. I'm not sure if I can, if I'm even allowed to do this. If they're both Pilots, they should work. I just don't want to break open this black cartridge. So. It's a Con 70. Can I take this out? Can I take this out? What, what if I can't take it out? I don't think I can. Oh no. Wait, then how do I use this if I... I'm so lost. Okay. This is a Con 70. It's a sort of... I've never, seen, I've never actually seen one before, but you can see it's sort of a... It's like a squeezy tube, but you press from the top. Don't mind that. And here's a half used pilot cartridge from my pilot parallel. I'm just, I haven't washed this, you can just yeah, I haven't washed this at all. Should make it a few squeezes to ink up the feed. And I have some crappy copier paper, which I will just use right out. Oh, okay. We have achieved drip off. Oh, that should work. Okay. I'm going to need a sheet of paper. I might as well give it a quality treatment. I happen to have some Tomoreva. Pilot. Custom. Heritage. 912. This doesn't do it justice. Let's do that again. Oops. Oh, my flexi skills. The 
this is very very smooth this is a 14k sf nib this is not an official review i'm not going to write any draw anything but first impressions is wow that's actually really really smooth now, now that i can think of it it flexes i just call this a semi demi flex it has a soft nib I wouldn't call it flex, it is smooth. This is one of the smoothest uh, for comparison. I think this is on the same. Size comparison with my Sailor. Ah, uh, really dropped it. Very, very similar styling. Sailor has a bit of a well, flatter top. The pilot doesn't have a pilot thing on top. Um, Sailor does not flex, it's 21k. Yeah. Smoother than my Sailor, but also partially it's because I think it's because of soft nib. Soft nib means that it, the, the limb will give and, and it allows it to flow more freely. And it might be an ink thing, but otherwise, I am very happy with my shiny, fresh, there's no fresh pen smell, uh, shiny new Pilot Custom Heritage No. 1 2 SF nib. I think I will grow to like this SF nib. I like it. These two have potential. I'll get back to you on this one later, at some later dates, but for now, first impressions are very positive. That's enough. I'll, I'll refill as necessary.